What's up everyone? This is Karan here back with another video. Welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. A lot of guys you are familiar with Magisk Manager. It is used as a root manager for a lot of devices and a lot of users are using this nowadays. But as like me, all of you are also bored of this same UI again and again, the same module section, same download section, same super user settings and all thing is totally same. So we are gonna change this UI, we are gonna change everything regarding to this app in this video. So make sure to watch this video till the end. Let's get started right now. Okay, so as you can see, this is Magisk Manager. I have installed 20.4 and as you can see, if you refresh it, you will see this is the updated version. But yes, we have a modded version of this because actually that is not a modded version, but that is actually the beta version. So we are going to install this right now. What you have to do is you have to download this APK. The link for this file is in the description. So make sure to download from there. Just click there and you will be redirected. You will prompt it to do this. You can see the version was 7.5.1, but now we are going to 7.6.5, which is actually the beta version of Magisk Manager app. You just have to click on install version. It will be installed successfully. As you can see, it's installed successfully. So how is this UI? Just open it. You will see a new UI like this. This looks just great. And new UI, total new look. It will show you Magisk. It will show you Manager, the latest version and installed version. Everything here status package their support things and everything is here this is the home screen of magisk which looks pretty much impressive as you already noticed it here you get the home option when you click here you will get the options of reboot reboot to bootloader reboot to download reboot to edl mode or reboot to recovery whichever you want to choose you can choose that one some extra options are available like this you can see which apps are using super user permissions right now on your device you also have the option to choose which are apps you want to choose which are apps you are using as a magisk hide which are apps you can choose to hide root access from safety net options are available here click on yes and it will show you the safety net status on your device right now as you can see safety net api error which means safety net status check is not passed which is something a bad thing if you're using magisk 20.4 if you're using other magisk version it could be passed but i am not sure about that it's all depend upon your device here you have other options you have the option logs where you can check out which which of the things are working which of the things are not you also can save these logs or you can delete these logs if you want to as you can see empty logs now and at last you have the option of updates you have the option of install things and a lot more things like when you go to updates whichever modules you have installed it will show you the update if it's available for that module or not if you want to install a module from storage you can simply click on storage grant the permission and you can install any module from storage if you have installed it you can enable or disable these things and uh, here you have all the modules which you can install right now on your device let me just show you by just clicking on this like if you install font changer you will see the information by clicking here about this module like this is a font changer allows you to use a download 200 fonts or whatever else it was just showing you just click on this button it will show you to download or install you can simply download this directly from here it will start downloading it will not take that much time so after downloading as you can see there is a progress bar available here also and after that you can directly install this right now from here these are the things you get here and when you click here you have the option of checking out which modules are here you have installed every info is available here looks pretty much impressive and this looks just awesome a new thing here when you go here these are the things you get here we already shown you so let's move on to settings here you have the option of customization where you can customize the themes new themes are available whichever theme you like you can choose that one so if you want to choose this theme it will look like this this is a new look of magisk manager looks pretty impressive as you can see and this is one of the best thing that you have the option of customize your magisk manager or your root access app you can also choose the language whichever language you like espanol francis english dutch or whichever language you like you can choose that one you can also choose the list arrangement to standard or squished whichever you like you can choose that one to update channel check updates 
hide magic manager magic hide a lot more options are available you can choose a super user access super user notification request timeout and a lot more these are the things you get in new magic manager app this is how you can update your magic and now look pretty much impressive so this was all from today's short and simple video i hope you like it don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks for watching goodbye